So yep. what we're going to talk about today is optimizing bids for keywords with low or no data, which is pretty much everybody's problem, especially at the beginning. But as they discover, you know, whatever is going on, still it's not enough. So tell us, how does one go about optimizing bids for keywords with low or no data? Yeah, well, I will just say fair warning to all the listeners. Uh, this to this topic is going to be a bit technical and I'm, I'm a bit of a geek on this type of stuff. So I can err on the side of being overly technical. So I'm going to start off by giving you a, a really short uh, kind of version of the answer and then we can dive into the weeds. But the short version of it is I'm a big proponent of the marketing strategy or sorry, the, the bidding strategy known as revenue per click bidding which is basically looking at a keyword's sales divided by your clicks and then multiplying that by your target ACOS or dividing it by your target ROAS. Either one is going to be the same. And then that's going to be how you calculate your bid. And so when it comes to these low data scenarios, you know, you've got a keyword with one click and one sale or one click and no sale. You know, what do you do in those scenarios? Does this still work? And I'm here to say, yes, it does. Um, but we just have to do some other kind of workarounds and ways to get additional data. And so I think we have some good systems that can be helpful for everyone listening. Okay. All right. So, so I'm going to translate everything you say. Okay. Yes. Perfect. So uh, also uh, I may need translating myself. So I'll ask some questions. So I, I will uh, clarify everything if needed. 